Yeah, so we're up here with KJ. Came up and got stuck in the snow on a nice, it was 70 degrees today. Yeah. It was a nice it was day. A beautiful day. Beautiful day, good stuff. Oh, even got the traction boards. Oh, yeah. Okay. That is just mush underneath that snow. Mm hmm. Ooh, deep over here. Okay. Well, I'll, uh, I'll probably back up there, spin around back in. Yep. And then just use the rope to pull you out back to that and be able to turn around back there just fine. Not the first time it's been in the mud, huh? <laughs> Probably nor the last. Get them to trip that out of there. Uh, yeah, I don't need it okay. that urgently. We can get to higher ground. Yeah. Wow, did I ever pull that just right? Look <laughs> at the distance. <laughs> when you get it right, you get it right. I'd love to tell you that was on purpose. Okay, so you can hop in, uh, fire it up. You'll be in reverse parking brake off and give just a little throttle as I start to pull and then once we're up here just let off and let me pull you sure. back there you can even ride the brakes a little to keep the rope okay. tight Yeah, I know. It's a mess. I'll go back, grab that camera and uh, your traction board. Oh, perfect. Thank you. I think I've got one. So there's only one up there? I think so. Okay. I guess I know. Back of the Jeep's a mess with gear. Normally I like to have it a little more organized than that, but I literally just grabbed everything out of the TJ and shoved it in there the other night to be able to take it to a recovery. And uh, I'd love to tell you I'm going to totally reorganize it, but I'm probably not. Uh, Actually, if anything, all that stuff's going to end up going in the Silver Dodge because we're quickly running out of track Jeep season. Uh, like I said, 70 degrees today, which is crazy. Oh, you guys would be very proud of me, though, because I uh, I did finally reorganize the whole tool setup on the, uh, here's the, camera, on, uh, the rollback, like I said I was going to do 100 times. Finally did it, so maybe I'll show you that at some point. So. One traction board. It's just soup underneath this snow. So once you break through the crust of it, you're in. Yeah, you're done. Okay. 360 camera. 
Perfect. Oh, that was a terrible idea. All right. And for those of you that ask why the camera doesn't show the stick, that's just something in the programming of these Insta360 cameras where they edit out the stick themselves. So in the footage, it just, it doesn't even exist. It's just not there. Don't ask me how they do it, but they do it. And it's really cool. Oh, that's bright. All right, I'm going to pull ahead here to give some turnaround room. around and look at everything all looks good so far these have been doing great like very very happy with them all right, we got some gas filled up in there because it's been a long day for KJ and then uh, we're gonna head back towards the truck which means more 360 camera shots of the Jeep I told KJ to go ahead and head home because KJ has had a very long day in the woods. I can get this loaded up by myself. i just pull up onto some flat here. Like so. Hey, beautiful, beautiful area out here. See, here's my problem when I'm in the woods. See this road right here? Where does it go? I don't know, but I want to know. So I want to drive out that road. And then if I see a branch off of another road, I'm going to want to drive out that one to see where it goes. And that just continues and continues until it's three days later and I'm still out in the woods and realize I need to go home. So. That's, that's kind of an issue I have when I'm in the woods. God, it's so tempting. Okay, let's not load on the trailer. And let's go explore. thing
that be a toilet? Oh, the old school wood seats that would like split and crack and then when you sit on them, they'd pinch your butt cheek. That shouldn't be out here. So you know my truck bed camper that I bought? Uh, places like this are exactly what I bought that for. Throw it in the back of the truck, come up somewhere like this, because we, we drove up the road a little ways from the toilet area. Um, just come somewhere like here, and you got a nice little fire pit set up. Just beautiful. You just walk off and hike in any direction and just explore. No trails, no need for none of that stuff. Just go for a walk in the woods. Look at that. Yep. Coming back for sure. Okay, we did some hiking. We explored around a little bit. Drove up the hill a ways. Daylight is starting to fade, so we're going to head back towards the truck. Expensive camera down. You're okay. All, right, all tied down. I got my celebratory root beer here, and we are going to head down off this mountain. I still actually got quite a ways to go get out of here. I drove the truck a long ways up through some snow and stuff. So, unless I get stuck on the way down, that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed that. I definitely did, especially that last part when we went up the mountain exploring. So, that's it for this one. I'll see you next time.